In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NBA games happening on December 27, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games, so four picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports, let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NBA games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Philadelphia 76ers vs. Orlando Magic In the realm of Eastern Conference basketball, two formidable teams engage in a fierce battle in the vibrant Sunshine State, seeking victory on the hardwood. The Philadelphia 76ers, currently on a road expedition, clash with the Orlando Magic on a Wednesday night. Philadelphia's recent outing resulted in a 119-113 defeat at the hands of the Miami Heat in South Beach on Christmas night, failing to cover as a two-point underdog. Meanwhile, Orlando, having been in action on the road against Washington the previous night, faces the challenge of a back-to-back -back game scenario. The Magic triumphed over the Pacers 117-110 in their preceding contest, defying odds as a two-and-a-half-point underdog. Although Orlando holds an 80-49 historical advantage in the regular season series, the 76ers have dominated recent encounters, winning 11 of the last 12 matchups. Notably, their most recent clash on February 1, 2023, concluded with a 105-94 victory for the 76ers on their home court. The Philadelphia 76ers exhibit commendable form, securing victories in eight of their last 10 games. Despite this impressive run, they aim to rebound from a recent setback, succumbing to the Miami Heat 119-113 in a road duel on Christmas Day. Tobias Harris led the charge with a stellar performance, contributing 27 points, 7 rebounds, and 6 assists. Noteworthy contributions also came from Kelly Albert Jr., who sunk 6 three-pointers for 25 points, and Mo Bamba, providing a spark off the bench with 18 points. Despite shooting 42% from the field and rallying with 37 points in the third quarter, the 76ers faltered in the final stretch. As they look to regroup, they anticipate a clash with the Rockets in their subsequent matchup. On the other side, the Orlando Magic, having split their last eight games, seek a third consecutive win following a hard-fought 127-119 road victory against the Wizards. Franz Wagner led the charge with 28 points, 8 rebounds, and 9 assists, supported by Paolo Banchero's 24 points and Anthony Black's 23 points. Orlando's effective shooting, 52% from the field and 12 of 26 from beyond the arc, secured them the win in a closely contested encounter. The upcoming matchup presents challenges for both teams, with the 76ers missing key players Joel Embiid and Nicholas Bottom, while the Magic cope without Joe Inglez and Kevon Harris. Orlando, playing in the second game of a back-to-back -back and having to travel back home after the Washington game, faces fatigue. Conversely, the 76ers enjoy a rest advantage, having made a shorter trip from Miami. Philadelphia is optimistic about Embiid's return, aiming to extend his impressive 30-10 streak. Despite his absence in the previous game against the Heat, the 76ers showcased resilience, rallying from a 21-point deficit before running out of steam. Although the 76ers had a strong momentum before the Christmas Day loss, Maxi's off night and Embiid's absence impacted their performance. The Magic, despite recent wins, displayed vulnerability in their narrow victory over the league-worst Pistons. While the Magic are favored at home, the prediction leans towards the 76ers bouncing back, leveraging a fatigued Magic squad. Therefore, the Philadelphia 76ers to cover the spread as underdogs is our full-game side pick. Philadelphia, currently ranked 12th in pace in the Eastern Conference, faces uncertainties regarding Joel Embiid's availability. In his potential absence, the spotlight shifts to Tyrese Maxey, indicating a faster-paced game for the 76ers. Maxey, despite a challenging outing against the Miami Heat, shooting 4 for 20 on Christmas Day, is anticipated to rebound and deliver a strong performance. The Magic, positioned in the middle of the pack in terms of pace, find themselves in a significant matchup against the season Sixers. Expectations are set for both teams to enter the game with heightened readiness, making over the projected total the preferred choice as our full game total pick.
Toronto Raptors vs. Washington Wizards. A showdown is set to unfold in the nation's capital this Wednesday, featuring two Eastern Conference rivals. Taking center stage at the Capital One Arena, the Toronto Raptors are making a return to action after a hiatus since last Saturday. Meanwhile, the Washington Wizards are treating their home crowd to another game for the second consecutive night. This midweek tip-off marks the second encounter between these franchises in the current season, with Toronto securing a 111-107 victory in their initial clash back in November. The lingering question now is whether the Raptors will replicate their success or if the Wizards have devised new strategies to turn the tables. The Washington Wizards find themselves in a challenging phase, having lost 10 of their last 12 games. Eager to break a two-game skid, they enter this matchup on the heels of a 127-119 defeat to the Magic on the preceding night. Leading the Wizards in the scoring column was Jordan Poole, contributing 30 points on 11 of 20 shooting. Tyus Jones added 22 points along alongside six assists, while Daniel Gafford recorded 13 points, 13 rebounds, and three blocks. Despite shooting 49% from the field and connecting on 16 of 42 three-point attempts, the Wizards succumbed to a third-quarter onslaught, allowing 35 points and trailing by as much as 17. Denny Abdija had a forgettable night, managing just two points on a one-of-seven shooting performance. Meanwhile, the Toronto Raptors, also facing a rough patch, seek to halt a three-game skid following a 126-119 loss to the Jazz. Scotty Barnes led the team with an impressive stat line of 32 points, 14 rebounds, and seven assists. However, the Raptors squandered a promising first-half lead, surrendering 41 points in the final quarter. With upcoming matchups against the Celtics, Pistons, and Cavaliers, the Raptors are eager to reverse their recent misfortunes. In a back-to-back -back scenario, the Washington Wizards, having played the Orlando Magic on Tuesday, embark on this contest amidst a challenging season of rebuilding. The team's future hangs in the balance, with uncertainties surrounding the role of Jordan Poole, who averages 17 and and a half points and 3.6 assists while shooting 40.8% from the field and 31.3% from beyond the arc. Trapped with his substantial contract, the Wizards must navigate the season with Poole, contemplating whether he fits into their long-term plans. On the other side, the Raptors, stuck in mediocrity this season, await potential trades involving key players like Pascal Siakam, or Og Ananobi before the looming trade deadline. Taking a stance on the upcoming matchup, an apprehension towards backing the Washington Wizards on the second night of a back-to-back -back emerges. Simultaneously, a reluctance to favor the Raptors with a considerable point spread, given their inconsistent performance and three consecutive losses, is evident. The Raptors' recent struggles include a home defeat to the Jazz, prompting reservations about laying seven points with them on the road. Notably, the Raptors have failed to cover the spread in eight of their last ten games. In light of Toronto's turbulent form, a cautious approach is warranted. Despite the Wizards being on a back-to-back, -back, an inclination towards them emerging victorious is expressed. Thus, the Washington Wizards to cover the spread as underdogs is our full-game side pick. As the stage is set for an Eastern Conference clash, the Washington Wizards claim the top spot in the NBA's pace rankings. Both teams find themselves in precarious positions, with the Wizards sporting a 5-23 record for the season, while the Toronto Raptors contemplate significant roster changes. Foreseeing a game characterized by minimal defensive intensity, expectations are high for the Wizards to dictate the tempo against a struggling Toronto squad. A notable contributor to Washington's efforts is Corey Kispert, showcasing his impact as a key figure in the second unit. Having consistently tallied at least 15 points in seven outings, including two of the last five contests, Kispert provides a valuable spark for the Wizards. In consideration of the anticipated fast-paced nature of the game, our full full game game total pick leans towards the over, reflecting the expectation of a high-scoring affair. Milwaukee Bucks vs. Brooklyn Nets Milwaukee is extending its stay in the vibrant city of New York for a significant encounter with the Nets on Wednesday night. The Bucks, with a season record of 22-8 straight up and 13-16-1 against the spread, experienced a setback against the Knicks on Christmas Day, succumbing to a 129-122 defeat as minus three-point favorites. In contrast, Brooklyn, standing at 15-15 straight up and 18-13-1 against the spread, contributed to the Pistons' historical journey by securing a 118-112 victory on Tuesday night. As of late, the Milwaukee Bucks have been showcasing exceptional form, winning 9 out of their last 11 games. However, their aspirations were thwarted by a loss to the Knicks on Christmas Day, ending their 7-game winning streak. 
Despite the setback, the team, led by Giannis Antetokounmpo's 32 points, 13 rebounds, and 6 assists, along with noteworthy performances from Damian Lillard and K.A. Tris Middleton, demonstrated offensive prowess. Although shooting at 47% from the field and 13 of 42 from beyond the arc, their defensive lapses in the first quarter proved costly, resulting in a challenging comeback after trailing by 16 points. Contrastingly, the Brooklyn Nets seem to have rebounded from a five-game slide and are now eyeing a third consecutive victory following their narrow 118-112 road win against the Pistons. Cam Johnson spearheaded the team with 24 points, supported by Mikkel Bridges and Cam Thomas. The Nets exhibited a 50% shooting accuracy and a pivotal 13-0 run in the fourth quarter to secure the hard-fought win. Looking ahead, they are set to face the Wizards after the upcoming game against the Bucks. In terms of player availability, the Bucks might face challenges with Giannis Antetokounmpo listed as questionable, while the Nets continue to miss Lonnie Walker and Ben Simmons. Reflecting on their previous clash in November, the Bucks emerged victorious with a 129-125 scoreline. The Nets now possess momentum and confidence, presenting a formidable challenge for the Bucks. Despite Milwaukee's earlier success, the Nets' recent wins and the potential absence of Antetokounmpo could impact the outcome. Milwaukee holds an 8-2 straight up and 6-4 against the spread record against Brooklyn in their last 10 encounters. Before their interruption by the Knicks on Christmas Day, the Bucks were on an impressive winning streak. However, they must collectively step up in the absence of Antetokounmpo. Meanwhile, the Nets' recent narrow win over the Pistons raises questions about their form, especially facing the Bucks in a back-to-back -back scenario. Despite the uncertainty surrounding Antetokounmpo, the Bucks remain a formidable team, and with offensive capabilities showcased against the Nets in November, they are poised to secure a victory, with Damian Lillard expected to play a significant role. Despite the possibility of Giannis Antetokounmpo's absence, the Milwaukee Bucks remain a potent force. Force, contrasting with the Nets' recent struggles and the challenge of a back-to-back -back game. While the Nets have covered numbers this season, the Bucks, with or without Antetokounmpo, possess ample firepower. Anticipating a standout performance from Lillard, the Milwaukee Bucks to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. In their previous encounter earlier in the season, these two teams combined for an impressive 254 points. The current season statistics favor the over, with a 35-23-1 record between the Bucks and the Nets. Milwaukee's recent offensive prowess, averaging 132 points in the last eight games and a minimum of 118 points in their last 11 games, adds to the likelihood of a high-scoring affair. Brooklyn, despite occasional offensive hiccups, has scored at least 117 points in their last three games. Considering the pace rankings by DunksandThrees.com, placing the Bucks fourth and the Nets 20th, a balanced and high-tempo game is expected. The over has a 20-10 record in Bucks games, making it the fourth highest over winning percentage in the NBA, and is 3-1 when Brooklyn plays without rest. Both teams find themselves in the bottom half of the NBA in defensive rating, suggesting the potential for a high-scoring matchup. The ability of both squads to excel from beyond the arc and Milwaukee's efficiency in the paint further supports the expectation of a high-scoring game. With the Bucks ranking second in effective field goal percentage and averaging the fourth most possessions per game, the stage is set for an exciting, fast-paced game at Barclays Center. Thus, over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed, subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.